ADM 300 multifunction survey meter is the best meter for civilian use when it comes to fallout survey. It can measure up to 100,000 R an hour, which is extreme, and down to 10 micro rankings an hour, which is ambient background. The units are EMP resistant, built for EMP. They're the primary survey item for the Air Force. The Air Force uses these for environmental and accident level survey. It can use smart probes, like a PP100 beta probe, the uh, plutonium x-ray probe, and other probes. You can find these on eBay uh, once in a while. You do not have to calibrate the meter and the probe together since the probe has its built-in high voltage and that is done separate. The unit now is on the screen measuring uh, the decimeter function giving me the ambient background. As you can see here, this is my dose of 277 micro -rankings. When you initially power up the unit by pressing the power button, it starts off in rate. Micro rank is an hour rate. We'll turn it off and turn it on. You press the power button for one second or two, the unit will go into a built-in self-test and begin the measurement. The asterisk you see in the side of rate, that means that the audio, the clicking is off, but the alarm audio is on. The moment you press the audio button, it disables that, and then when you press it back on, it turns on the clicking and alarm, but you cannot get the silent mode unless you power it off and turn it back on without touching the audio board. This is a useful feature to have as a fall alarm during any event. Pressing the mode button once, shows you your integrated dose, 277 micro rankings. Pressing the mode button again, shows you the rate alarm set to 50 micro rankings an hour. That's a pretty low level and will alarm an ambient uh, contamination. Let's say a, a small accident or the initial fallout plume begins to enter your vicinity. Then the alarm will go off. At that point, you would set it to a much higher level. This is the dose alarm for 5 Rankin 5R. And then there is a survey mode which allows you to survey different spots up to 100 locations and get a uh, basically it will count for about two minutes and give you an average uh, dose, dose rate an hour. So you can survey spots in your shelter and look for the best area with the lowest uh, gamma ground or sky shine. So this is the unit. It is also water resistant. You can decontaminate the unit with water and soap. It won't enter the unit. This is why it uses this heavy duty, uh, basically flat panel buttons. The units come with a nice case. These units also come with a pouch so you can have a spare set of batteries as well. Uh, the ADM 300 is very robust. It weighs quite a bit but it's very heavy duty like I said EMP resistant and it is a current uh, survey meter used by the Air Force there will be other videos showing you how to do other things like set alarms and other special features of this meter